Hello, and welcome to your short on time restorative practice. For today's class, you'll want a bolster, blanket, and two blocks. My name is Caitlin, and I will facilitate today's session. Know that you have arrived, and if it feels right, you let out a good exhale. Today we'll begin in reclined bound angle. Set your bolster long ways behind you, zipper side down, so it doesn't agitate your back. Next, you'll grab your blanket. You fold that up. Put it to the back small edge of your bolster so you have padding underneath your neck and your head. Come to your seat just in front of that bolster but not on it. Any sensitivity in the sacrum, put about a fist width distance between back body and bolster. Guide the soles of your feet together, and when your knees splay open wide, put your two blocks at your outer thighs, knees, or calves. Hands to the floor and start to recline over that pillow or bolster setup. Organize your blanket, let it catch the curve in your neck and the back of your head. If there are any additionals, consider glasses, a wristwatch, or piece of jewelry. Set any of those extras to the right or left side of your space. That way, in real time, you are as comfortable as you possibly can be. To support your settling process, take a deep breath in. And open mouth, exhale to release. Let's take two more like that. Feel your body breathe in through your belly, your ribs, and your chest. And open mouth, expel stale breath. Last time through without holding anything back, feel a deep breath in. And a complete breath out. And allowing your eyes to close, your lips to seal. Start to breathe slow and steady in through your nose and down to your belly. Out through your nose, soften your belly. Breathing in this pattern, it's meant to help you feel a little more regulated and grounded, right? Connected to your body and this present moment. Take advantage of the spaciousness, right? The shape of this posture where your hips are open and there's a supported curve in your back. The front of your torso is exposed, but also safe. All of these nuances, they make up the here and now, and you get to practice breathing with and through this rest and relaxation. And while physically your chest is open and broad, energetically your heart is open. Please take these last few moments in the first pose to clarify your intention, your reason for slowing down and carving out time for a restorative practice. with your intention clear in your heart. Simultaneously, it's at the forefront of your focused mind. Start to invite small changes into your fingers. Wiggle them, spread them, curl them. Do the same thing with your feet, and then close off your hips, close off your knees. Constructive rest. Angle your toes in and knock your bent knees together. Start to windshield wiper your knees to the right and to the left. If the two blocks are in the way, please clear them out from your sides. Whichever way your knees fall, look in the opposite direction. And eventually, you take a full body stretch. Lengthen arms and legs. Relax your arms anywhere to the floor and bend into your knees. Roll to fetal pose. A continuation of your surrender. Knees high, chin low. And extend your top leg long, press palms into the ground, gradually lift shoulders and head. 
Next, we'll set space for twisted child pose. So you'll have that bolster out in front of you. Grab your two blocks. You'll wedge them underneath the bolster. You want them to progressively get higher, so first to second setting or second to third setting. Then angle that bolster over top. Please be sure the bottom edge stays connected to the ground. Connect your outer left thigh, your outer left hip to that bolster, and then place a blanket in between your legs. Hands frame the bolster and start to fold over it, melt over it, allowing your heart and your head to be held. If you'd like to twist your neck, lift your head and gaze towards the left shoulder. However, if that doesn't feel restorative, please honor that observation. Unwind your neck and keep your gaze in the same direction as your bent knees. Let your shoulders release out of your ears and your belly get soft. No, it's not terribly long. Maximize the time you do have in this twist and forward bend as you watch the breath. As you organize the breath on purpose. Take your time as you awaken your fingers. Press your palms into the floor and lift your spine, neck, and head. Take that blanket, put it on the bolster. You'll pass through a table top and then connect your outer right thigh or outer right hip to the bolster. Put that folded blanket between your legs. Hands frame the bolster, roll the right shoulder back, and begin to fold. Let your abdominals, front ribs, and chest be held by that pillow. Remember, if you'd like to twist your neck, bring a slow lift into your head and gaze towards the right. Please be honest, though, if that doesn't feel restful or relaxing, unwind your neck and keep your gaze in the same direction as your knees, please. 
the props and these longer holds and rest, they are meant to stimulate the parasympathetic nervous system. And it is there you reduce your stress, you quiet the mind, and you ground in your body. Only if you are ready, awaken your fingers, press into palms, come up to a comfortable seat. That can be on your bolster, a folded blanket, or one of your blocks. Sukhasana, easy seated pose, your ankles cross, your knees drop down. As you ground into your sitting bones, Anjali Mudra, prayer palms at the heart. Just as you've created space in the physical body throughout these postures, now you create space in the mind through the prayer of loving kindness. May all beings be happy. May all beings be healthy. May all beings be safe. May all beings know peace. May all beings find their freedom. May all beings move through the world with ease. And my hope for you is that your practice, your healing is continuous, your heart steady and of benefit to the family of all beings. Take a big breath in and a complete breath out. Together we bow forward. Namaste. We close this practice. I do hope that you enjoyed from this short window of time and restoration. Be kind to yourself and be kind to others, and I hope to see you in another video soon. Bye.